I am live in the Middle Peninsula and Deltaville where we are really noticing the winds picking up. As y'all know, Dorian is well to our south, coming in as a Category 1 hurricane, made landfall earlier on in Moorhead City. But the system itself is going to continue to move north and east. However, we're still going to be dealing with impacts, but they do vary from location. Over into the Norfolk location, as well as Hampton Roads, that's going to be the gustiest. That's where we're going to see the highest rain totals. Some of them will see upwards of around four inches at times with those wind gusts 50 to 60 miles per hour. Now, where I am over in through the Middle Peninsula as well as the Northern Neck, we are definitely dealing with the wind and the rain is picking back up. It is falling slanted and I look for our rain accumulations to be on the lower side with some locations around two inches, but majority of us around one to one and a half. And those wind gusts will be sticking around, gusting all the way up into the 50s at times. Now, the central areas, you're not under that tropical storm warning. However, it's still going to be a windy day. This is not your typical skirt alert, kind of laugh it off. You've got to pay attention and be smart about it, especially if you have a high-profile vehicle, you're traveling over bridges and overpasses, because we will be dealing with those gusts 20 to 40 miles per hour. It's windy out here, and it's going to continue. We'll have more details coming up. All right, thanks, Nikki D. And some of those schools closed.